Hey there guys, I'm the Gaming Lemon. I have another Minecraft Xbox 360 video for you guys today. Before I start the video, I just want to uh, explain the sort of gameplay in the background. Um, as most of you know, I did a video yesterday of me uh, blowing up my Lemoncraft world. And that's what this is. I just want to do a little follow up of that video because a lot of people got really confused and quite angry and quite sad as well uh, because I blew up the Lemoncraft world and they didn't really understand why. Quite a lot of people, but I thought I explained it a number of times. But um, if you haven't seen that video, by the way, just look at my previous video. And um, the reason I did blow it up because uh, I've said many times that I'm going to start a new Lemoncraft world in the 1.8 update. And uh, people also didn't understand why again. Um, it's because so I could uh, uh, explore a new world in a 1.8 generation so then I could uh, get all the structures like strongholds, NPC villages and all that kind of good jazz. So that's what I was going to do. A lot of people also got angry because uh, at the end of the video I showed uh, me saving the game. Uh, I, I'm going to be honest, I didn't really. I didn't actually save the game because uh, I, although I pressed exit and save uh, it said uh, are you sure you want to overwrite this world and then I pressed cancel. Uh, but I didn't show that bit, so I didn't actually save the game, guys, uh, don't worry, I did keep it just for memories, uh, so I'm a liar, you know, c call me a liar, whatever. <laughs> but that's not what I wanted to talk about today, today I wanted to uh, discuss what's coming next after 1.8 update, what is the next update we will be receiving? Now, a lot of people are going to get uh, uh, post in the comments something like, oh, why, why are you talking about the next update already, we don't even have the 1.8 update yet. Well, it's a good point, but uh, you can't stop people asking what's next, you know. Uh, when the 1.7 update came out, as soon as it came out, literally people were just like, Yeah, the update's here! So when's 1.8 coming out? And, you know, the, the, re the rest is history. So as soon as 1.8 comes out, uh, uh, it might not be straight away, but after a few days or a week maximum, people are going to start going, When's the next update out? And what's in the next update? Blah, 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 blah. Oh, well, initially, I thought, and everyone else thought, that the next update was going to be the 1.2 update. The 1.2 update included, like, a... Uh, the NPC villages, uh, because uh, in the 1.8 update uh, it has NPC um, villages, but it didn't have the villagers, you know, the actual villager mobs. I'm not too sure why they could have implemented it into the uh, actual update, and uh, it was also going to contain jungles and a lot of other good uh, stuff and whatnot. And you know, and you know, that's uh, what we thought. That's what we uh, was going to happen. But then um, I asked 4J Studios on Twitter. Um, I think I did actually. I'm not sure if it was me because. Uh, I, I tweeted them and they've replied back a, a number of times now and I can't remember what question I asked them but I'm pretty sure it was this one I said uh, uh, just to make sure is the next update going to be the 1.2 update or is it going to be something else and they replied back saying that uh, the next update uh, they, w they were going to do 1.2 but um, they might do another update in between uh, 1.8 and 1.2 so it might be a 1.9, 1.0, 1.1 update uh, just something in between uh, that will contain some stuff from 1.2 so it will stop having to uh, make people wait because the 1.2 update is also a massive update just like the 1.8 update and it will take a long time to do. The only reason the 1.7 update only took a month or so to do was that because you know that there wasn't a lot to add. The main things they really added was pistons and TNT you know, they added shears and uh, uh, stuff that would trigger TNT but uh, they, they, they weren't massive uh, things. And when I say they added TNT, I meant uh, they uh, added a. They, they had to make it so there was a trigger to activate TNT. So the only massive difference was uh, textures. Um, redstone has to uh, trigger TNT now, and also pistons. Pistons was the main thing. Because 1.8 update has so much stuff, that's why it's taking so long, and it's finally done. So uh, in the update in between, they might include uh, stuff like enchantments and breeding, just uh, stuff that people really like from the 1.2 update into a uh, in-between update. That will only take like a month or so to do, so people won't have to wait so long. B but if I think this will happen, I'm not too sure. Because uh, every gaming company, not just 4J Studios, they have kind of a uh, limit on uh, what updates they can do before they have to start paying a uh, certain amount for them. I think it's like a $10,000 or $1,000, something like that. So they want to do as little updates as possible and also spread it out as much as possible because I think it's also based on, you know, the time of when you do it. They can't just release an update and then go, oh, hey, yeah, we have another one ready. Here you go. Uh, they have to wait a specific time or else they'll have to pay, I think. I'm not too sure on that, sorry if I'm wrong, uh, I'm sure someone will correct me in the comment section below. So if they do another update and then another update after that, then they might have to start paying or they won't have to release it as quick. So I just think uh, they'll release a 1.8 update and then they'll start working on a 1.2 update, but I'm not too sure, they might even call it something different for some reason. And also because uh, it doesn't matter if it takes really long because we'll all be enjoying the 1.8 update, right? Because I know loads and loads of you guys have been uh, 
really excited for the 1.8 update. So some people are like posting comments like, I can't even sleep because I'm that excited for the 1.8 update. But it might not even be the 1.2 update. You know, uh, it, it could be called a 1.2 update, but it might not contain anything from the PC version. Actually, no, I, uh, I didn't mean that. I uh, mean uh, it might contain stuff that's uh, not in the PC version. Because uh, Notch did say that he wanted the Xbox version to have exclusive features. Uh, so, so, you know, it's worth buying if you're PC, because there uh, are some people who play PC like, Oh, w what's the point in buying the Xbox version if I have it on a PC? Ha ha ha. It's, you know, it's always a good uh, question, so I'm not for the idea of adding exclusive features to the Xbox version. Just like the uh, the iOS version, which uh, has, like, blue flowers, but I'm pretty sure you wouldn't uh, spend a six quid on the iOS version, and the only difference is, like, blue flowers or, like, little stuff like that. But I think that's uh, quite unlikely. I think they'll still be working to the PC version because uh, 4J Studios did, did say they were working to the uh, 1.8 update PC version, then the 1.2 update PC version, and then then they're going to discuss what they do from there. They didn't mention anything about 1.3, but then again, they did mention that before 1.3 was released, so they didn't know anything about 1.3. So we, you know, we're going to have to wait and see. We're not too sure about the future, but we know that the future will be a. Uh, Another update up, up to 1.2 features. So to sum it up, uh, they it will probably be the 1.2 update. However, they will they may do another update in between that might include like stuff like enchantments and breeding, just so just so uh, it will shorten the wait between the updates because 1.2 is also a massive update. So that means it will take a long time to uh, you know work on. I mean, updates do take a long time to work on, guys. You know, don't. St because I always see a lot of people saying, Oh, 4J Studios, oh, I hate them, they're, t they're taking so long on the update, and they're so lazy, blah, blah, blah. Okay, you guys, you did, I'm, 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 I might sound like a dick here, but you know, you, you're not, you don't know anything about working uh, updates or like making games or anything. It does take a lot of time. You know, they have to take time. It's, you know, they're not being lazy and they're not, they're not a bad company because they're making games and it takes a lot of effort to do so. So don't go uh, saying that crap, it really does get me annoyed. Um, uh, sorry if I kind of sound like a dick there, I, I don't mean to, but when I try and get a point across, I always do, uh, according to some people. But thanks uh, for this uh, so sort of commentary thing, I may have went over the gameplay, sorry if I did. Uh, if you did enjoy the video, please do leave a like on the video, as it really does help me out, and thank you very much if you did, I really do appreciate every like I get. Post what you think about this in the comment section below, subscribe if you're new here for more Minecraft Xbox 360 content, mainly news, and guys, I'll see you in the next video. Lemon out.